Okay, so I'm first taking my Maybelline Superstay 24 hour concealer and I'm just going to dot it under my eyes first off on any blemishes I may have around my nose and on my chin. And then I'm just going to take my Sedona Lace concealer brush, the pink one, and just blend that out into the skin. Now I'm taking my Sarah G Cosmetics Oil Free Foundation, the foundation brush by Sedona Lace, and I'm just going to apply that all over my face. And I like to do that first, just kind of apply it in the places that I want to put it and then blend it out. And this gives a really flawless, kind of natural look. Now I'm using FYF's Impeccable Loose Powder Foundation and with the big fluffy powder brush just blend that into the skin and just mattify it a little bit more. Now I'm taking the angled brush by Sedona Lace and I'm using the Boho Beauty palette by The Body Shop and I'm just going to define my brows with the lighter brown shade. Now I'm using the contouring brush by Sedona Lace and The Body Shop's bronzing powder and I'm just going to contour the face. Mary Kate and Ashley Olsen kind of have like a very bronzed look, especially in this picture. So I'm going to contour the cheekbones, just place it underneath, onto the temples and up into the hairline. And this will just like slim out the face and kind of make it a little bit more bronzy. Now I'm just going to define underneath the jawline, just for a more chiseled look. And now I don't usually do my nose, I don't usually put it on my nose, but today I am. Now I'm taking P2's Sunny Blush, and this is in the shade Summer Flirt, and I'm using the Sedona Lace Kabuki brush for that, and I'm just going to apply it to the apples of the cheeks, just for a warm glow. Now I'm taking a little bit more of the concealer, the Maybelline Superstay Concealer, and with the concealer brush I'm just going to put it onto my lids and then pack, just pat it on with my fingers just to kind of prime them. Now I'm taking the Body Shop's um, Eye Definer in brown and I'm just going to apply that as a base, kind of messily onto my lids. I'm taking the Sedona Lace Flat Blending Brush and I'm just going to soften that and just kind of blend it out. Now from the Sedona Lace 88 Warm Palette, I'm taking a mixture of two matte brown shades. With my flat eyeshadow brush, I'm just going to apply that all over the base that I just put on. Next, I'm taking the Shimmery Bronze color, and I'm going to apply that with the same brush all over what I just did. Next I'm taking the pencil brush and I'm going to go in with the same shimmery bronze and just apply it to the lower lash line. Now I'm taking the angled brush and I'm just going to go in with a burnt orange. This has a little bit of shimmer to it, it's a really nice burnt orange shade. And I'm going to apply that up onto the crease and this just gives a pop of colour. Now I'm taking a fluffy brush and I'm going to go in with a kind of apricot skin color shade. It's this one right here and I'm going to apply that to the brow bone as a highlight and then I'm also going to apply it just a little bit to the inner corners of the eyes. Now I'm taking the same angled brush as before with the same orange, burnt orange and putting it on the lower lash line. Now I'm taking the pencil brush again and I'm going to go in with a matte black and applying that to the outer V just to intensify the look a little bit more. Now I'm taking the brown eye definer by The Body Shop and just defining the waterline. And lastly, I'm just going to apply some mascara. This is CoverGirl's Lash Blast to the top and bottom lashes. Now I'm using In The Nude Lipstick by Essence and the Sedona Lace Pink Lip Brush. And I'm just going to apply that to my lips. 
So that's the entire look. I just took my hair down because the Olsen twins always seem to have like a middle parting and kind of loose waves, which is what I have right now. I hope you guys like it. Um, let me just kind of do a close up and show you guys. Um, it's just a brown smoky eye with a pop of color with the orange and I really like this I think it's actually really nice to wear with like warm colors and um, It's kind of an autumny look more so than a summery one, but I really like it So let me know what you think and I will talk to you all in my next video. Bye